Good Sunday, everyone. Our weather map shows showers to our southeast for today. And it looks like those are going to stay to our southeast. I know a few of you south of I-40 south of this Sunday morning have probably seen a couple of showers and sprinkles around. But um, those are moving east and moving out of our area. And that is going to leave high pressure in control. You see that area of high pressure over toward Kansas. That will be sliding eastward. And we should even see some sunshine by this afternoon, it looks like. So the system is progressing right along. And as you can see, there's no other major storm system just yet to our west. Look our five-day forecast brought to you by Clearview Closet and Blind. Got just a 10% chance for a sprinkle or a light shower this morning. Otherwise, becoming partly cloudy today. Highs in the mid-50s. Northwest breeze at 10, maybe getting up to 15 at times. Monday, mostly sunny. Tuesday, mostly sunny. Monday, we hit 61. Tuesday, we step it up 10 degrees to 71. And those southwest winds, 10 to 15 gusts to 20 on Saturday, going to help us get that temperature warmed up. And then Wednesday, just a slight chance for a morning shower. That, that'll probably come in like later in the night Tuesday. So Tuesday night into early morning Wednesday, maybe a shower. Um, and that's it for the five day for precipitation. Highs in the mid 60s on Wednesday. And then Thursday, partly cloudy skies, highs in the mid to upper 60s. So we're going to be needing some rain because April is normally a wet month. And now we've gone this last week without anything incredibly significant. And now we're going to go next week without anything incredibly significant, at least through Thursday. So don't be surprised if we start popping up on that drought monitor again for at least dry conditions. Maybe not drought, but at least drier than we need to be this time of the year. Um, the big headline from this five-day forecast is the frost coming tonight. So make sure that you're aware of that if you have anything that you want to keep a little safer out there. Um, temperatures dropping down in the low 30s tonight. Upper Carmel Window Cleaning brings you your Sunday lunchtime forecast. Temperature should be around 50, 51, 52 degrees at your lunchtime. Partly cloudy skies by then. And just a north breeze at 10 miles per hour. Premier Generators gives us our threat graphic, and I'm sure they're proud to say no current threats, at least through Thursday. There are indications the pattern will become more active as we get in the next weekend, so stay tuned. On this day in 1972, Apollo 16's John Young, Mission Commander, and Charles Duke, Lunar Module Pilot, began their three-day stay on the moon. In the picture below, whoops, and that's in the blog if you want to see that picture, Young solicits the American flag with the lunar module and lunar mo roving vehicle in the background. So that lunar rover vehicle was that lunar roving vehicle was developed by NASA's Marshall Space Center, um, was used for collecting rocks and data on the lunar highlands, and that is still up there today. And uh, they can ride that thing the next time they get up there. You folks have a wonderful Sunday and keep looking up. For more weather information, meteorologistmark.com.